Well, hey, hello. My name is Reed. I'm the headmaster here at Cresswell Hall. You know, I work with a great group of people. My RAs, they're an impressive bunch. And I don't like to throw around greatest or best of all time. But if you think that's appropriate, then sure. We can say the word best of all time. Shabazz, yes, Shabazz. She's very, she's one of the most respectful people I know. She's a little timid sometimes. Look, lady, if your son hadn't had that little harlot up in there, I wouldn't have had to write him up. Oh, no, don't you, don't you, don't back talk me. But when she comes out of her show a little bit, she's one of the nice people I know. <gasps> what? Farpa. Yeah, Jared um, came to me last spring talking about how excited he was to be in a co-res building. And I think he's really opening up to that opportunity. So housing policies, there's, there's a lot of them, but I've made sure I've read them cover to cover, um, especially the rule about checking girls out. Read that one. My only concern with Caitlin is telling her that she, sometimes she needs to take a break. Sometimes she works too hard. I guess um, as a third year RA, my motto would be minimal effort, maximum results. You can work too hard and sometimes she does that. Audrey, you! Nice shot! Oh, yeah! All right, on duty. Oh, that is too much paperwork. Chris, he's someone who's always around the hall. If you could choose one face of the hall of someone who's always around, it's Chris. Bailey Martin, you know, you know, she, she's the backbone of the staff, you know. <laughs> I can't handle it anymore. <laughs> I just can't do it. <laughs> she's strong, she's firm, and she knows what she's doing. <laughs> yeah, Ben, he's my senior array. It's a positive role model. I can always count on them and be happy. Always in a good mood. Always. I have a mini fridge. He has a little bit more responsibility, and I can trust him with that. I'm not afraid to let him do his own thing sometimes. As a senior RA, I'm charged with managing a desk. Cresswell has a barrel. No, oh, hold on, one of my IAs is calling. No, you can come in 20 minutes late. That's fine, just you're fired. Yeah, Dana Ditto is the one we can rely on when it comes to diversity and inclusiveness. She's really, she's really concerned about accessibility issues. John Sims. If I could uh, go into a lab and create some RA with qualities from this person, from this person, from that person, mix them all up, and a cauldron. John, be that RA. Okay. Nope. Now, Kayla just signed on recently. Uh, you can tell she's very enthusiastic about learning. She's come in with a, a humble heart. She's ready to learn. Being an RA is like the easiest job I have ever had. And training, seriously, that is for people that do not have it all together. <laughs> Her willingness to learn and absorb things really lets me know that she has a lot of potential to be a great RA. I look for her to be a senior RA someday, I do. Maybe even an, a Brie Hardy one day, or Anne Bailey. I've been thinking about my future in housing and I don't want to say I'm planning too far ahead, but I've already found some really cute wallpaper for my office in Herbert. I know there's kind of a, kind of a little bit of a stigma about Cresswell. I don't want to hear this talk about, oh, let's go to Cresswell and get crunk. Ah. This isn't crunkwell. No one is out here getting crunk. 
Okay, the police station used to be in Cresswell, but you know, that's, that's in our past. If you wanted to know exactly why the police department actually uh, moved out, well, if you were in Cresswell, you would move out too. Let's just say that. Here's more. Oh, thanks. Appreciate it. We don't need the police station here. We have the staff in place that's really enforcing the rules. Things are very much under control. You know, this may not be the newest residence hall or whatever. And our name might not have been dedicated within the past 25 years. We don't have large TVs. <laughs> yeah, you know? Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, just can you turn it off? Can you turn it off now? Thank you. I'm sorry.